Alright, so at this point, I'm just going to get out and see what happens. Hopefully. Have fun. Thanks. Let me just. I literally don't see it is the problem. I'm assuming it's gone. Shoot. It's not in, oh my god, you can see it right there, you can see it's paws, there's a fly on it, okay. This is farthest away, no, it's just sitting there. I just saw it's a little nose twitching, I think it's trying to move from out from underneath the thing. No, I am. Stay that camera. They're opening their shipment thing. I think that's fine. It went back underneath. I think it's just scared. You can see it moving. It's moving a lot. Make sure you don't use this dumpster because there's a raccoon in it. I just want to make sure you know. Alright. <sighs> you guys can see it moving now? Come over here. Come look. You can't. Uh... He's staring at me. <laughs> it's staring at me. <laughs> Okay, um, should I go try to get it again? Hurry up. Can you? I don't know if you can see it. Okay, I think I got more, so. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I have your phone. I don't know if that's the right coo moving. If, oh, I think it's the box. We're gonna try to find my phone so we can get a double. So my phone obviously is not falling in the crack of the car. I mean, I think we have a lot of footage now. So I think we'll be good, but. Oh, you can see I'm going under. Look at how cute. So the lady is getting mad though, now that I like told her and warned her. She just got super mad that I'm looking out for her safety. Like, okay, you're smart. But yeah, this is getting ready to stop recording. But yeah, we just saw no raccoon. All right, so we came back. It's been like quite a while. Oh so yeah, I don't know if you guys can see. It looks like he's stuck or hurt. I don't know if you guys can see the plastic in his mouth. We told the employees not to take the trash out and they like threw stuff in there right there by where he is. Still there? Yeah, he is still stuck. He's probably scared. Oh, you hit him! Sorry, sorry. Eat it. Eat it! Go on. Okay, that's enough. Gonna He's hurt. So we found some strawberries and all. He can't move. He's breathing heavy. He's probably so scared. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hit you. Hmm. Please try to eat them. Yeah. He's stuck in whatever that thing is, so. And it's stuck like on a circle. Like the thing is a loop, so we can't really get it. We're trying to feed okay. him. It's really hard to do though. I just don't want them to take the trash. I think he'll be okay. fine if I they don't take the trash yeah, out. He will too. He's scared and he's hiding. We're trying the best we can though. I have to put that up to his mouth and see what he does. Oh, is he reaching it? He's grabbing one of them. Yeah, he's eating one of the strawberries we gave him, so that's good. Don't grab that one, that's why I see him. 
So we're feeding it the strawberry. There you go. And he's he got it. Can you move that couple? I don't know how much of that we filmed because my phone is out of memory. But we untangled him as much as we could with our Alright guys, so I just got my phone because mine has recording space. But I don't know if you can see the little guy there. We just managed to get him untangled from this and we've as been much as we could. bringing strawberries over to him. I th we're are pretty sure he's completely Should untangled now. <laughs> so you guys, I don't know if you guys can tell. I don't when know. we were here earlier, these orange cups weren't weren't in here, and this is after we told them not to bring the trash out. So he's been eating that orange cup right there, and it's like stuck in his mouth. I think we're going to go ahead and head out now. Hopefully, it can get out. Yeah, we think we got it untangled, so he should be able to get out now. Yeah. Look at him; he's adorable. We're gonna go ahead and, and leave him for now. So yeah. All right, guys. So. We just got these two boxes. They're pretty thick, so we can. Yeah, he's still sitting there. We are going to. Do you want to hold this? Mm -hmm. We're gonna try and make a ramp so he can get out at night. He's like. That'll probably help some. There, baby. See, look at you can climb out if you need to. There, that looks like it'll help because he can crawl over there and then. So that's what we did. Poor guy. Yeah. He's still chilling there. You got your mouth open? You can see there's a little piece of plastic in his mouth. So, I feel so bad. Oh. Yeah, he can definitely move out of that now that we untangled it from him. He's probably just trying to sleep. So yeah, we got this little ramp here he should be able to walk up to. I guess we're just gonna come back and check in the morning. Yeah. And see. I don't know why he won't spit that plastic out. I don't know, maybe it's stuck there, but he should be able to get it out when he gets out. He has a like, little mouth open, I don't know if you can see. And you guys, we know, if you guys didn't know this either, if a raccoon is calm and it like will just go up to you, it has rabies. Yeah. So always be careful if you're taking a walk, if you're dumpster diving or whatever, and you see a raccoon. Hi, he's like trying to say hi. He's like, thank you. Thank you for the food. I don't know. He's cute. He's weird. So, yeah. We built him this ramp. He should, it should help him get up. What is wrong, little dude? He's like, opening He's his mouth. so adorable. It's stuck in his mouth. I think, I'm zooming in on his face. I don't know. I think that should be good for now. Isn't it, little buddy? All right. So we built him this ramp, and now we are going to head out for the night. And we're going to come back first thing in the morning mm -hmm. before, mm -hmm. like, really early there than usual so we can make sure this trash doesn't get picked up. He just moved his foot. Are you posing, little dude? Yeah. All right. Well, we're going to come early tomorrow, but for now, that's about it.